active, so... See if my sound's working. Please. I wonder where the care went for the board, so please get on with it. You heard it here first, folks. I don't give a shit about football. After all, I'm a nerd. I just like games. I get bloody murdered. So I like the sound of the game is actually coming through, which is good. It's going to turn me up a bit, so hopefully the comment is coming through alright. Hello Blue Jacket. Nice to see you again. More or less literally the moment stream, my stream happens you're always there which I love. So welcome. How's it in Georgia currently? And by the way just so you know if, if for any reason why I, I'm being quiet is because it is one in the morning here in Britain and I, my parents are just in the other room next door so hopefully I can keep the volume down but you can still hear me. So hopefully the sound's coming through alright. I can hear me alright on my iPod which I use for my chats. So this is if this will probably this will be the first time coming to one of these live streams. Um, it is a stream where it is literally just me playing a game, new game I've got which is as you can see Extinction. And I'm going to basically sort of do like a kind of a review, but it's just my first impression of me playing the game. Now, no way this is any way a re actual review. Um, so, to the game developer of this, I'm not reviewing the game at all. I am merely just playing it. I've bought the game because I thought I liked it. I'm going to play it and give my opinion on it at the end of it. And obviously, make all of you have a load of fun. Watch me probably fuck up because I haven't actually played it. So there, this is all literally a first impression. I will be learning all the controls, how to play, everything. So let's get straight into it. Oh, let me. Oh, oh, I do like the start. Of my book. Good art style. So that's giving some brownie points in my book. Thank you, Emma, for letting me know this sounds good. And thank you for letting me know as well, Blue Jacket. <laughs> yeah, if I could scream loud enough for your parents to hear me, Blue Jacket, then Jesus Christ. Like, right, ooh, so we've got chapters to this game. So, uh, campaign, jump into the chapter, so chapter 1. As the Ravani invasion engulfs the world, the kingdom of Dorlor is all that remains. Avril and Extra, Extra Exam arrive in Dorlor in search of King Yarrow in hopes of gaining the resolutions. So, oh, so there's uh, four acts. So first one is enemies at the gate, which shows some style of the same machine. If we complete some objectives, we can submit some of the stars and give us a work on how well we do in that mission. So first mission is enemy at the gates. Jack of Scouts have been seen to have the head of the invading Ravani. Avery and the most evacuate the cities of the Tobias. Tobias. Before the jackals ever run, the 
village, so primary objective is to rescue 15 civilians. <laughs> that is true, but um, my mum and dad do sleep like heaven, so hopefully that won't happen. It hasn't happened the past few times on our stream this late at night, so hopefully not. I know you're not trying to be mean, Blue Jacket, don't worry, okay? I know anything you say isn't in any way malicious. Right, I'm just going to turn the game audio down a bit because my lovely mother is a bit overbearing my voice. Is that okay? Let's switch it. The only why I'm literally going for a control for my TV though, it's because I've literally got one on the screen. But anyway, bonus medals, so this is probably where you get the extra stars from, is kill six jackals, rescue a rooftop civilian, and complete mention in under five minutes, so we may not complete that one, but give it a damn good go. So this, let's have a little look at this. From what I've heard, it is a bit like Attack on Titan, because of the giant enemies and all that, and you jumping around and trying to cut their limbs off and stuff. But whereas Attack on Titan is you are a bunch of anime, anime children flying around with zip lines, this is a bit different in my opinion. I would be but As children, we were told that our world once had heroes. Oh shit, he's fucked up. Fairy tales to inspire hope in a world with none. As far back as anyone could remember, mankind had been at war with itself. Oh, shit. Orphaned, like so many, I survived by the sword and my wits. Neither of which kept me from being sent to a labor camp. Child slavery? How dare they? It would have been a death sentence. Had I not made a friend. A veal kept me safe. Oh, a veal. And I kept him sane. And together, we would change the course of history. Oh, and I will admit, these look a lot different than your normal uh, titans out of uh, Attack on Titan. Uh, Avil, did you make it to Dolorum? Yes. I've almost reached the village of Tablis. You were right, Sandra. This place is completely untouched by the invasion. Have you made contact with the Royal Army? No. And I'm not exactly getting a warm reception from the locals. <laughs> I'm sure they can be seduced by your charms. <laughs> I was joking, sort of. They may, however, find you more appealing than the jackals about to descend on Tablis. In moments like this, I actually find myself missing your company, Zandra. How long do I have before the jackals arrive? Not long. If you don't act quickly, the villagers will be slaughtered. I've teleported escape That's crystals right. onto the battlefield. The you need only use one of the rune stones I gave you to activate them. I'll leave you to it. Someone help! The jackals are hunting down civilians. Wait. Use your basic attacks to slay them before they slaughter the villagers. Great work. Now charge the crystal to activate the portal and rescue the civilian. Okay, I want to admit, it's a bit annoying. Um, it just pauses. I don't understand what's happening. Speaking. What are those things? Feels a bit like stop start. Who stop, are start. you? Uh, My name is Avil, the last of the Sentinels. I am here to ready your people for war. I, I don't know anything about fighting monsters. There is something you can do for your people, something that will save thousands of lives. Tell me what to do, and I'll do it. Take this gemstone and personally see that your king receives it. 
And when he does, tell him to speak my name into the stone. Okay. Never jackal. The enemy has started killing civilians. Avil, you must now, act quickly. The mount the way out was running there. This ain't true. It's very true. Oh shit. And I want I'm very fast from it. If you're ever lost, you can review your objectives at any time. The people of Delorum shall be indebted to you, Avil. Going near gemstone. Oh. oh shit, I can jump. Hey. The people of Delorum shall be indebted to you, Avil. Oh, I just broke that poor market store. Fuck you. Nope, get away from that villager. Oh, I'm just that real world. I am in your death sentinel. See in Jackal, Jackal. Oh, see in a minute. Jackal. Oh, see minute. Oh. Oh shit. Come here, Jackal. I hear, I hear dying villager. Next time, dodge just before an attack hits you to avoid taking damage. It's probably not going to be this easy all the time, is it? Alright, I might turn the, music, the game volume down that little bit more, okay? Just to make it so you can hear me a bit better, because obviously I think and this makes sense, gets made into a video that goes on YouTube. I don't want it to be terribly shit. Right, there we go. Oh, why did I do that? Wrong button. Right. Come on, let's rescue the village. Some people have climbed onto their rooftops to hide from those monsters. Too bad I'm not much of a climber myself. Hmm. If I jump onto the side of the building, I can climb up the wall to reach the top. Don't say. Uh, I see him. Oh, cool. We're going to stop. So, so down the top. Oh, shit. That wasn't what I meant to do. <laughs> hey. Let's go. These refugees are lucky you showed up in time. Hello. I have rescued you, Madam Citizen. I see you to be getting my lovely civilians. You stay away, jackal scum. Oop. Oh, those rescues? Yeah, rescued 15. Do a flip, Abiel, yo. Congratulations. You're still Sit alive. Paused mid flip. <laughs> the portals are opening as you said they would. I was able to send many of the townspeople to safety. <sighs> it isn't enough. I know. I sent your speaking stone off to the king. We'll see if he, in his royal wisdom, sees fit to make an alliance, or if he is as foolish as those who fell before him. I know how you feel, but we're out of options. We will need to coordinate with the royal forces to fight the coming hordes, and we're going to need them soon. Mm, the jackals I killed. They were scouts. Yes. I hope you're ready, because the Raveni will be attacking soon. Okay. There we go. So that's our first mission. Tutorial. And I got all the objectives done. Nice. So, RB to upgrade skills. Now, I don't know what to do with that, so I'm just going to leave that alone for the moment. 
Ooh, new skill unlocked. Purchase now. Vault height. Use SP to purchase new skills. So, okay. Hasty portals. Lightfoot. So I'm guessing we're probably going to fight a Reveni now. Yeah, Titan Wrath. Titan's Wrath. A Reveni has been spotted approaching the city of Petrel. Avil must defend the outskirts of Petil while he awaits the king's response. Excuse me. Welcome back, baby. No, I don't think you're about all oh, um, blue jacket. Not all. Destroy two armor, oh, kill eight jackals, complete in under seven minutes. And execute the Raveni. Oh, this is looking to be fun. Yeah, I've missed much by the way, baby. All we've learned is how I can how quick I can move the sort of stop starting of the conversations you have, which is a bit off putting. And uh, killed a few jackals and learnt the weird way we're rescuing civilians by getting them near crystals, the ramming near like crystals like monsters. Has King Euro made contact yet? Magic so far, away. nothing but silence. Avil, we will need alliances to win this war. The most expedient way to convince the king of our intent is to continue fighting for his people and defending his cities. And when you do speak with the king, may I suggest employing a morsel of diplomacy? I will think on it, Sandra. Now, tell me of our enemy. What is their location? Last we spoke, they were on course for petrol. You've arrived just in time. The Horde has almost reached the city limits. Now go, and show the people of petrol how a Raveni dies. Executing Raveni requires rune energy. Charge your rune energy by killing jackals and rescuing civilians. I didn't call you a baby. Oh, right. The enemy has started Shit. killing civilians! You leave that civilian, no, you bastard. He be free, civilian. Leave the civilian alone. Okay, you're dead. Excellent work, Is this really safe? Thanks. I guess. I was shut the fuck up. I was in you for a magical pool. Be at it now. You saved the right man. I am a spice trader. The richest in all of Delorum. Anything you want, my friend, I will make it yours. I need you to simply send a message to your king. I gave him the means to contact me directly. Have him do so immediately. I could have known that one had you beat. These refugees are lucky you showed up in time. <laughs> so you're a three-headed dog, Jack, uh, Blue Jacket. Uh, if you don't know what that is, it's Harry Potter. You haven't seen Harry Potter, I might go. What is this tower? We use the watchtowers to keep an eye out for threats. From the top, you can see far beyond the outskirts of Petrol. I bet climbing the watchtowers would give me a better vantage point. <laughs> really? I didn't think it would, considering I've played Assassin's Creed. They've never proven good watchtowers. Uh, I see. So I'm 
Oh, I see. The one is about to get attacked. Oh, Alright, oh, 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 shit, that man is fucking jumping. If it weren't for your noble efforts, I would be dead. This is only the beginning. If any of us are going to survive what's coming, I need your king to work with me. I have a contact on the court. I will send urgent word. Ooh, my sword is gone. Kill strike. Ready. God save us all! Oh, shit. Oh dear. Look who's early. Avil, get after that Raveni before he starts destroying the town. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Avil, you remember how this works. Hold your rune strike and aim at the Raveni's armor and limbs. Release rune strike to attack. Oh shit. Someone help! Oh, your armor. Avil, hold your rune strike and aim at the Raveni's armor to destroy it. Okay. Great job. Keep it up. Great job, Avil. Removing a Raveni's armor and severing its limbs also charges your rune energy. Once you have enough, you will be Bad able to jacket. execute Thank the Raveni. Now aim your rune strike just below the Raveni's knee to sever its leg. Okay, this is going for you both, but sod it. I've got to hit the weak points when they are glowing. Oh, that, oh, that is brutal. Now finish this. Climb to the base of the Raveni's skull. The ogre's neck will glow when you can target it for your rune strike. Achievement on Great work, Avil. That's hard. one less Raveni we have to kill. It's a drop in the ocean. If we don't begin coordinating our efforts with the royal army, we will soon be overrun by their numbers. When word of your bravery reaches the king, he will be compelled to trust you. And while we wait for the fool king to gather his courage, the Raveni marshal their forces. You are more right than you know. Another horde is approaching, and this one is better armed. The next town will not be as fortunate as the last. That was a bit too easy in my opinion. But, obviously it was still showing us what to do. But hey, just have to keep going and see how it goes. If it doesn't turn out to be, a, if I literally am just speed running through this, then it might turn into a completion for it or not. Alright, see you later, um, sweet dream. See you tomorrow. So, next the mission we're going to do is the Iron Giant. With no word from the king, Avil encounters a heavily armored Raveni making its way to Dolor. Execute the iron, the iron armored Raveni. Bonus medals, destroy four armor, kill one of any with both legs, and complete, complete the mission in under six minutes. Right, so, this base health. So, what height? This is base for 5.5%. Uh, 
Hasty portals, risky things, caves, and that would be actually rather helpful, but it does seem to take a long ass while to actually do that. Okay. Ooh, another achievement. Strong. Lovely attractive view here for you guys, just me scratching my back. Ugh. Sorry the stream was later than usual, than it was meant to be. It's just that I've finished work late and obviously had a few issues where the Avil, video capture card you've arrived wasn't just in time. The first of the Raveni are already approaching the town. I see you finished deploying the escape crystals as well. I'll slay this monster and save as many as I can. Well, what I know is where is she? She's talking about Reveal really. that Raveni seems to be wearing some kind of heavy armor. Are you sure you can handle it? You worry about getting your crystals to the surrounding town, Sandra. I'll worry about the Raveni. Okay. Uh, let's do this. Ooh. That was well positioned. Avil, remember. Executing Raveni requires rune energy. Charge your rune energy by killing jackals and rescuing civilians. Try taking those out first. No challenge at all. Time to kill a Raveni. Died in one fucking hit. Oh, well, that wasn't good. But the good thing is, at least we can bang. <laughs> Shit, that could have been my get his head. Alright, that's. that's how it is. Ooh, that was close. Get to your butt. to regain your health.
Cover to regain your health. Shit. Oh no, I'm near the edge of the wall. This ain't good. Oh no. Oh no. Right, let's see. Right. Wait. Come on. Oh, damn it, he's they're really tearing this place up. Fucking prick, mate. Will you stop it? Just let me kill you. There we go. We're gone. Who are you? You all right? No, I got fucking smashed in the face, love. Where, oh, there's only 42% of the town left. Oh shit, it can grow its leg back like that. Lovely. Not gross at all. Got that damage. <laughs> oh shit. To waste. Fuck, just Get back in there, reveal. Like fucking fly. Severing a Raveni's limb will only hinder them momentarily. After a short time, the Raveni will regenerate its severed limbs. Cut your leg off again. Goodbye to life. You don't know, fly? No, I'm saying he swapped me out of the sky like a fly. Damn it, it couldn't do it under the time. Ah, well. We did do the arm, though, so there we go. Shit. Say goodbye to your He has one as well, there you go, he's got no arms now. And no legs! Oh, you poor, poor thing. Now you just screw that back up. Nope. Say no to your legs. No to limbs. No limbs for you. Oh, he's getting his limbs back. 
I've got to hit the weak points when they are glowing. I must find cover to regain my health. No shit, Sherlock. I know that, but as you probably guessed, I don't much really. Oh, you piece of shit! Fuck you and your arm. Really cruel and natural torch, what I'm doing here, to be honest. Because I'm just literally massive on this thing. That is limp up again and again. And a butcher. A butcher of revenge. Go on, climb. Right. Let me. Let me. Just. Oh, shit. Let me. Ooh, ooh. Let me jump. Flipping more. For crying out loud, all I want to do is slice your bloody head off. Let me slice your damn head off, you. Bit of lag there, because I did jump, already jump over his head, but it was being a bit of a. Oh, come on! Literally, because he's too busy looking down his fucking maggot-sized dick, it wouldn't let me do it. No. No challenge at all. A veal. Valid rune strike targets will glow when you aim at them. Yeah, I know, I know, love. For God's sake, I'm trying my hardest, but this prick is just being a bit of a douchebag today. He is. Come on. Yes! Uh. I've got to hit the weak points when they are glowing. Now, Avil, execute the Raveni! Bitch! Jump off! Oh, nice work, Avil. These people owe you their lives. This time, Sandra. But what of the next? And the next? Without the King's aid, we're relegated to a single battlefield, while the Raveni push forward on multiple fronts. The right, Avil. Which is why we must convince him to join us. This war will not be won by swords alone. So we were able to kill the Raveni and take both its legs, got rid of the armor, but we didn't do it in under six minutes, so got two out of three, which ain't bad. Ooh, gained the new skill, expert combat. Have a look at that one. Oh, so, and last of chapter one's uh, acts, I would call it, is Royal Proposition. Up for uh, just a little look. So it is expert combat. Allows a field to attack while dodging. Unlocking new combo possibilities. Oh, that sounds cool. Right. Let's some more elf on Right. So. Trouble arrives in the city of Maltinama. Maltinama. Just as word from the king. From King Yaro finally arrives. A veal must defend Maltinama. Against the invader of any forces to gain the king's confidence. Oh, what a prick, as if we hadn't done it enough already. So, defend the city of Motima, rescue 16 civilians, complete mission with 30% extinction meter, uh, and complete mission under 8 minutes. I'm assuming the extinction meter is the city where it says percentage, so hopefully we'll try and keep that above 30. Just hope there's not like 12 of any coming at once, otherwise that's going to be diabolical. Lovely uh, stream this is, because I'm just scratching constantly, Jesus Christ. 
I'm sorry I'm not talking as much as I usually do. It's just I had a bit of a day at work today. But oh well, I'm still going to stream and I am enjoying myself while doing it. This is King Euro, ruler of Dolorum. Uh, I think you have you requested an like audience. To know that your name is Yaro. This is Avil, the last sentinel, and I wish to strike an alliance with your highness. Was it your sorcery that created this speaking stone? My ally, Xandra, crafted this instrument, and others from the weapons of our enemies. If your boons are so great, why do you seek an alliance? King Euro, I cannot be everywhere. At this moment, I am approaching Moltnema, Moltnema, where a deadly horde approaches. Moltnema? No, that's too soon. I dispatched a garrison to the city, but they won't arrive in time. If you are as skilled as I have heard, Avil, then please, save as many of my people as you can. Alright, let's quickly just get some civilians out of there before... Good to see my portals are holding up. of the town is destroyed. Uh, light bitch. I cannot be talking to my trying to save civilians. Uh, there we go. Charge up my rune energy to take this thing down. Good luck! Now go behead a Raveni. Let's get the lock first. Great job. Keep it up. Cut the leg off. Avil, execute the Raveni. I know what to do, you silly. Avil, valid rune strike targets will glow when you aim at them. I know that woman. I'm just trying to get to the Death to the Raveni. Your work here isn't done yet. No, that Raveni you just executed wasn't the only one on its way to Moltnema. Oh shit. It looks like this Raveni brought along a friend. You'll have to face them both. When you execute a Raveni, your rune energy will begin to drain. You will need to build it up again in... So we need to build it up again. Right, let's quickly get these wings, because they're in the red zone. And I see why. Hang on, hang on, I'm coming. Someone help! My people are being slain left and right. Avil, what are you doing? I'm a fucking desperate because there are a lot of fucking enemies here. I just killed one just like fucking rescue. I must be a rescue. Alright, so is that that tower, okay? Alright, let's keep going. My people are dying of you. You cannot let this happen. Avil, you must 
must protect the city and its people. If it falls, we have lost. So this is not going to be as I God damn it. You should build more rune energy. There's no time Fuck. to waste. Get back in there, Avil. Like an insect. An insignificant bug to be stepped upon by people like him. This is difficult, this is. A lot more difficult than Attack on Time, I wouldn't know. Any destroy the city of Eel. Yeah. You are the people's only hope. I need my rune energy fully charged to execute this Raveni. I'm dealing with two giant ass pricks. Right, come on. Let's move it. I'll have to charge up my rune energy to take this thing down. Strike targets will glow when you aim at them. Give me the weak point. Damn it, that didn't work. to charge up my rune energy to take this thing down. Thank you. What many of my people owe you their lives. Blue jacket. We are still losing too many. I agree. <coughs> Your ally, Zandra. She creates your weapons. The Raveni use a rare mineral to travel between worlds. Zandra was able to fabricate this talking stone and our own portals from similar materials. 
I have at my disposal some of the most gifted alchemists, and even they do not understand the properties of this talking stone. Zandra is brilliant in many ways, yet as skilled as we are, she and I will not be enough to win this war. Will you combine your forces with our own to defeat this enemy, your highness? Initially, I was reluctant to believe your claims. I had always thought the Sentinels to be a myth, a story to put children to bed. And now? I believe. You bloody well better, mate. So we must use 16 civilians where we didn't stop the extinction now. Um, right. So we earned a rune slowdown, to skill, rune gravity, and rune energy overflow. Cool. So this is quite a fun game to play really, it's like a challenge game. So I think this is one I'll continue streaming. Right. As it's approaching an hour and I only do first impressions for an hour. Yeah, my first impression of this game, well, the, while the talking between characters is a bit clunky and it's very much like stop start, stop start. I really still like the game. It's very challenging trying to deal with more than one with any. As we found, it was very easy when dealing with one, but when you had to deal with taking the armor off and all that, it was like so. It took so much time just to do that, and then you've got the other of any to deal with. It's very annoying, but very gratifying when you actually can do it. So it's a good challenge and I like a game that presents me the challenge because sometimes with games it becomes boring if you can just do it really easily. But I really like the graphics as well. The art style is very nice. If there was a bit more like an actual kind of more of a story for me, like you actually saw other characters and actually had conversation with them instead of just this sort of subtitle thing. I'd probably enjoy it even more. I'm not saying it's so bad though, because I'd still, I'm still am going to continue playing it. So you may see some more of this, guys. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this first impression. If you did, don't forget to come to my next live stream, which will be this Friday. Um, as of today, though, what I'm going to be doing from, from now on is when it's the weekend when I'm going around Emma's Nana Grandad's because the internet is very poor I'm going to be streaming on a Friday and then if there's a game that I want to stream that isn't exactly one I'm going to put on YouTube and or, or, on, or keep as a video I'm going to I will stream it but if there isn't then unfortunately as of I will obviously let you know when it's happening that I'll go around Emma's Nana and Grandad's but as of that, Friday will be the only other day I stream, and then until next weekend, where I will be streaming once again on Wednesday, then on a Friday and Saturday. But I hope that's not, hopefully that's not a problem. It's just that I want the video quality for some of the games that I want to stream to be better. Because I've seen some of the Fallout streams I did when I was around Emma's Nans and it was constantly lagging and all that, and I really like how crisp and clear it came through with the last stream. So hopefully you'll see some more of that, not tomorrow, but Friday. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this stream. If you have, don't forget to click the notifications above so you can be notified of one of my next stream is. Uh, you can also follow me on Twitter and Instagram to be, get some extra notifications and see some of my awesome pictures of when me and Em went to Wembley and saw Ed Sheeran playing. It was absolutely amazing. The atmosphere was brilliant. And some of, maybe some of my model photos and if you want to watch some of my previous streams just go to YouTube and type in Wolf Reaper 54 my emblem is a little a little grim reaper with a scythe it looks a bit like um, a Star Wars um, oh Jawa when it goes Houtini but anyway enough about that I hope you have a very nice day wherever you are in the world or a nice evening if you're going to bed now 
I'm going to probably relax for a bit and then go to bed. But thank you very much for watching this first impressions and I hope to see you soon. Bye bye.